How does a booster seat work? Skelly represents a child riding without a booster seat. You can see that the lap belt is high on the abdomen. That puts the soft internal organs and spine in danger of injury during a crash when Skelly is thrown forward. The shoulders part of the seat belt is also up on the neck, which can also endanger the spine. Watch what happens when we put a booster seat underneath Skelly. Now that Skelly is raised to be closer to adult height, the booster seat helps position the vehicle seat belt over the strongest bones of his body, this bony pelvis and the center of his shoulder. This allows the seat belt to restrain the child properly by the strong bones of their body, not by their soft internal organs and spine. Children may complain about using a booster seat, but they need to use one until they are at least four foot nine and can pass the five step test for a proper belt fit. Lap belt low on the lap, touching the tops of the thighs. Shoulder belt centered on the shoulder. Lower back all the way against the vehicle seat. Knees bent comfortably at the edge of the seat and the child can sit this way for the entire trip.